Hi guys, my name is Pat Busby. I'm a strength and conditioning specialist here at ProEdge, and today we're working on power and plyometrics as it pertains to speed. So the first exercise for power that we're going to look at is called a hanging high pull. So for this, we're going to get into some triple extension and some full body power that's really going to help with, uh, with speed. So gripping the bar shoulder width and then he's going to end up coming right up onto his toes. Like I said, triple extension uh, with a big hip drive. That's really going to help your, uh, your acceleration. So here we want to really see that, like I said, that triple extension right through his knees, hips and his ankles. Um, the bar's got to be moving with some velocity uh, and a big hip drive that's really going to help the, uh, the speed development of the exercise. Okay, the next exercise for power and plyometrics we're going to look at is going to be called a depth jump. Um, so our athlete's going to start on the box, he's going to step off with one foot, make sure he lands on two feet, okay, with his shoulders right over top of his knees. He's going to clear the hurdle and, uh, and then stick his landing. So on this exercise we want to make sure that the athlete isn't on the ground for too long and there's some continuous movement there. If he's pausing, then he's going to waste some of that energy uh, that's stored in the muscles. So we want to make sure that we're really using the height of the box to his advantage and there's continuous movement. Um, to allow him to get over that hurdle. All right, so the next power and plyometric exercise we're going to look at is going to be a variation of a jumping split squat here. Uh, great exercise for replicating sprinting technique um, and also just developing the full body power from head to toe. Okay, so the next power exercise we're going to look at here is a repetitive uh, jump squat with some resistance. Again, the resistance is great for providing or for creating a little extra adaptation in the lower body here. Um, so we're going to make sure that he's getting good height on his jump and getting into uh, triple extension again uh, through each one of the jumps. So the athlete wants to keep his chest up, his arms are going to stay straight, and he's going to finish with his toes pointed so he gets full extension through his hips, knees, and his legs. Okay, so those are a few great exercises that are going to help improve your power and plyometric uh, movements. Um, so if you'd like more to see more details on that stuff, we've written a program for you. Um, so just click the link below um, so that you can do some of this stuff on your own.